A few weeks ago I made a video on Scallop and actually that same week they held an AMA where they announced a rebranding to eMoney Network. Now eMoney Network is the world's first Mika compliant modular blockchain and it serves as an L1 blockchain designed for seamless interoperability between DeFi 2.0 and RWA tokenization. Effectively establishing a network that bridges the liquidity divided between Web 2.0 and Web 3.0. In this video, I'm going to tell you all about it. To fully understand this project, let's quickly look at some background info. In 2020, Scallop started with a vision to establish an ecosystem in which cryptocurrency users can use their digital assets freely without any of the obstacles that currently hinder their adoption and usage. Scallop is a regulated neobank. And what's important to know is that Scallop will be the parent company holding all the licenses having e-money as one of its primary products. So that brings us to here, the introduction and beginning of e-money network, a pioneering modular real world asset chain with compliance blocks. It is compliant with Mika regulations, making it ready for the future in the digital asset landscape. E-money network will enable tokenization of real world assets, so RWAs, and by building the foundational blockchain, they want to help bridge the liquidity gap between the traditional web 2.0 and the new web 3.0 worlds and vice versa. Now the platform empowers users to manage crypto non-fungible tokens and tokenized assets, facilitating smooth transitions between crypto and fiat. Enjoying rapid transactions with minimal settlement times all within the confines of the world's first regulated wallet on the eMoney network. Now the eMoney network wallet is available both as a user-friendly app and a browser extension. Signing up is easy, but what sets eMoney network wallet apart is its bank-like registration process. Upon sign up, users complete a secure verification process, submitting their ID card, facial features, biometrics, and other relevant information. Now once approved, users receive their wallet wallet address on the eMoney network, which is a groundbreaking move in blockchain technology. The wallet address is also, and pay attention to this, an eBond, which really distinguishes this project from everybody else out there in the crypto space. They will issue cards linked to users their wallet addresses. Now users can visit any website, proceed to the payment page and choose eMoney as the preferred payment option. Whether you're booking flights, hotels or buying coffee, the eMoney network wallet simplifies crypto spending with a user-friendly interface. And when users send traditional fiat to their Scallop eBond addresses, a real-time minting process occurs on the Scallop chain, creating an eMoney token. Now this token is backed at a rate of one to one by a transferred amount in the corresponding currency, ensuring a seamless conversion. Their white paper has a comprehensive explanation on this entire process and I highly encourage you to check it out. And before we move on to the testnet, I want to remind you all that I'm not a registered financial advisor, okay? My videos are meant to be educational and entertaining only. Always do your own research and only invest money you're willing to lose because even though you can gain a lot in crypto, you will most likely lose it all. Now, because you're all very dear to me and I like to help you keep your crypto safe, I was actually able to work out a deal with Decent. They are a hardware manufacturer which offers two types of hardware wallets. Now the first one is a biometric hardware wallet allowing you to log in and verify transactions with your fingerprint. And then the second one is their all-in-one card wallet, which is a credit card sized hardware wallet and ideal for on the go. Now the best thing about this hardware wallet is that you don't need to charge it or you don't need to connect it to your computer, but all you need is the NFC technology together with your phone to do your transactions and manage your cryptocurrencies. And because they are actually the sponsor of this channel, I'm able to offer you a $30 discount by using the link down below. Now the sponsor of this video in particular is the eMoney Network team. So a big shout out to them as well for helping me achieve my dreams. And while you're checking out links anyway, be sure to join me in my free Telegram as well where I share news quicker than I do on this channel because these videos take a long time to produce. Right, let's move on with the video. An essential part of the smart contract development environment is the explorer which indexes and serves blockchain data. Now currently their testnet is active and we're going to look at it in a minute. In blockchain technology, a testnet is an instance of a blockchain powered by the same or a newer version of the underlying software to be used for testing and experimentation without risks to real funds on the main chain. Now, testnet coins 
are actually separate and distinct from the official mainnet coins. They don't have value and they can be obtained freely from faucets. Testnets allow for development of blockchain applications without the risk of losing funds. And right now, we're going to switch to my computer where I'll showcase you the testnet of eMoney Network. All right, so we're behind the computer and we're going to create a new wallet. Introducing eMoney, your gateway to the world of crypto and Web3. With just a click, effortlessly navigate between accounts and change, currently supporting Ethereum and Polkadot ecosystem systems with more change coming soon experience seamless access to multiple chains all in one wallet let's click create a new wallet and now i need to give it a username give an email id and create a password so that's what i'm going to do i'm going to sign off on the terms and conditions and i'm going to click next then I need to confirm my password, so I'm going to do that. Click next, and now I've got an OTP in my mailbox. So I'm going to open up my mailbox, and I'm going to enter that code. I'm going to click verify OTP, and we've got the sum sub KYC. Now Scallop X verification, you're about to submit sensitive data to Scallop X. If you receive this link from a suspicious source, please close this page and notify us immediately. I'm going to click continue. Step one is email verification. Step two is provide personal information. I'm going to click continue on this device. I'm going to pick the country that I live in. I need to fill in my email address again, send the verification code, go back to my email again, then grab that code and copy it all the way here. I need to fill in a first name, last name, date of birth. So I'm just going to make something up for the sake of this tutorial. Let's click continue. They are processing my data. And now my profile has been verified. It now shows my secret recovery phrase, which I'm going to write down someplace and store it safely. And once I've done that, I'm going to click next. And now we need to double check it. I need to select the right words, click next. And now my wallet is ready. I get a pop-up, pin the eMoney wallet extension, go to the extension tab on your browser, find eMoney wallet, click on the pin icon to pin it. Now we can follow them on LinkedIn, Telegram, their blog, X or Twitter and Instagram. And then you click finish. And now you see that you can open up the extension of the eMoney network. You can unlock it with your password. Same with MetaMask, for instance. Click unlock and you will be brought to your wallet. Right. We've got an EVM account right here. We've got the eMoney network, Gurley, Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, and so on. We don't have any EMYC, so that's the token of this project in our wallet. But we can use the faucet to get some tokens to work with this wallet. So let's go to their faucet by using this link down here. Now this faucet transfers test token on eMoney chain testnet, confirm details before submitting. I can enter my wallet address. So for that, I need my extension. So I've opened that one up. So my wallet is up here in the top left. I'm going to copy that address and I'm going to paste it here to get ourselves. So EMYC, going to click submit, I'm getting send test tokens to my wallet right now so i have to wait till this is done and in the meantime we're just going to look at the wallet something we've got a deposit page over here we've got the withdrawal page over here so we can withdraw our tokens then on the bottom we have our e-money so right now it's five thousand euro because it's a test net we have an activity tab which shows the account transactions that have been happening on this account. I don't have any, so you don't see any right here. And then we've got an NFT tab which is coming soon, which will show your NFTs as well. So this tab, the assets tab, will show your assets in this wallet. And you can find the desired networks on the right side. Now, in case you want to rename your wallet, you can go up here. Click here and you can rename it or you can add another account. It's basically a MetaMask on steroids as they like to call it, especially because the IBAN is being integrated with it, which makes on and off ramping your crypto to fiat much, much more easy. And then it's time to show you the testnet itself. So we've got a dashboard which shows things like network activity, transactions going on, number of accounts being made. We see live updates from transactions over here. And we see five countries, 10 validators and 10 nodes. So then we've got the blocks. 
that shows you all the blocks that have happened. We've got the transaction, which shows you all the transactions that have happened on the testnet, the different validators with their commission and their voting power. And then we have the faucet, which I showed you a minute ago, where you can actually grab some EMYC tokens from to go and play around with this testnet. Then we've got the docs that will take you to a document page where you can find all the information that you need in order for you to use their testnet. Right, let's go back to the studio. So this project is constantly building and evolving and that's why it's important to follow all of their socials. This will give you the latest updates on this project and their newly created Discord is a great place to start where you can find all the necessary information. Now that's it for now. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Doei!